This commercial by Bounty won't even let me rewind the commercial. I don't like it. I really don't. There's no other information on screen about why this ad down there. No other information. No, really. There used to be some information somewhere fucking telling you where the YouTube channel was for the ads. I don't like that commercial because it says skip the dirty hand towel and use a disposable paper towel. That's promoting waste. You know, just let me break down this commercial. Its core premise is don't use a dirty hand towel that can be washed and reused and made clean again. Use a disposable one and give us money for this product. You know, correct me if I'm wrong, but for the last year, there's been this uh, fucking sanitary outbreak. This fucking thing that you mongoloids keep calling COVID-19. It's the Pac-Man virus. That's what it is. Correct me if I'm mistaken here, but shouldn't your company not be focusing on making a fucking commercial and instead actually helping people deal with this fucking situation? Hmm? Whoever fucking company makes bounty paper towels... Yeah, should, shouldn't you be doing that? As opposed to profiteering, capitalizing on this situation. What the fuck is wrong with you? I can point to dozens of other commercials by dozens of other companies. Why the fuck are you making commercials, laying off workers left and right, spending the money you could be using to support those workers, keep their jobs... So that they can feed their families, keep their homes. And why are you taking that money and spending it on fucking marketing? Yeah, answer me that fucking question. That's the, that's the two fucking levels of sheer fucking de detached from the reality of the situation that's going on. Just looking at the surface level of one com commercial, just one line out of it. Don't use a dirty hand towel. Use Bounty. Use a fucking disposable one-time use throwaway paper towel. When a hand towel can be washed and reused many times. Often m more clean than the fucking paper towels, because you have to go to the store and pick them up. Yeah, get the store. Guess what? Millions of fucking people go to the store every day. Millions. Then one day you could get up to. Let's be generously conservative with the estimate. Ten thousand, ten thousand people. Unique individual, not repeat, repeating. 10,000 people going in the store every day. Average. Conservatively. Generously conservatively. That's 10,000 opportunities to spread dirtiness, as you want to claim in your commercial bounty. 10,000 opportunities to spread some dirtiness. Even on the packaging of your product. What are you going to do? Require everyone to wear fucking hazmat suits walking into the goddamn Walmart? You're fucking out of your head. Whoever made that commercial, you're fucking stupid. And I know, yet 99.9% .9 of Americans are that fucking stupid too. To believe that narcissistic, self-adulatory bullshit. 
Google, YouTube, Alphabet. You want to fucking make a difference? Tell the advertisers, yeah, that ad's not going to play. We're going to pull it because it doesn't, it, it just doesn't fucking know. It, it's, it's just complete fucking bullshit. People can watch things at home and it'll be a dozen times cleaner. Because it's staying in their home. It's isolated and self-contained because their towels, yeah, that's staying in their home. They're not going off to the store and spreading pathogen during a fucking pandemic. So no, that commercial is just fucking stupid. No bounty. No. Why don't you fucking tell them that, YouTube, Google, and Alphabet? Or is, you know, Susan Widgey bitch, you know, too focused on cramming a diamond-encrusted solid platinum dildo into her fucking hole? That's the only reason you want so much fucking money that I can see logically. Some expensive fucking sex toy. Or it psychosomatically gets you off. If you think this is edgy, no, this is realistic. This is equitable. This is your fair share of fuck you. There's a lot of it to go around. Don't even get me started on the bureaucrats and politicians. Special listeners, interest groups just fucking paying for dumb shit like this to be done because they own stock in the company. That's like the fourth or fifth level down in just how fucking detached and disjointed from the reality of reality that this, this one commercial really fucking is. Personally, don't own stock in whatever company owns the bounty brand. And after some nonsense with what Microsoft pulled a while back, I dumped their stock as well. Right now, <laughs> I've got I've got one fucking share of of the uh, British tobacco stock because I, yeah I would rather own stock in a company whose product literally gives you cancer and kills you as opposed to owning stock in a company that only wants to extort as much money from you and inhibit your ability to live your life as you see fit as possible yeah I'd rather buy stock in the company that manufactures cyanide and arsenic and, and rat poison. I'd rather do that as opposed to owning stock in some of these companies that are making these advertisements because they're just so disjointed and disconnected from reality. <clears throat> as much as I could go on whinging about it, I hope I've made my point. I really do. Till next time, toodles.